Hi, and welcome back to another episode of Titan Controls University. Today we're going to be talking about the Atlas III CO2 monitor controller. The Atlas III has a high parts per million setting, a low parts per million setting. This is known as a hysteresis. It has a setup and calibration feature, and as you can see, it has a light to tell you when your CO2 output is on. Here we can set our high parts per million anywhere from uh, 400 to 2,000 parts per million. Uh, for this demonstration, I'm going to set it at 1,250. The next thing I want to do is set my low number. This is when it's going to activate at the low end. So I'm going to set that at 1,050. That will give me a 200 parts per million. It's the uh, The next button down here, this puts it in the F11 mode. This is for a daytime only mode. It has a daytime only mode for CO2 enrichment, a nighttime only mode for CO2 enrichment, a day and night mode for CO2 enrichment, or it can be used as a night uh, only evacuation of CO2, a day only evacuation CO2, or a day and night evacuation of CO2. You'll also note that we have a calibration feature here, easy access by getting into the calibration feature. You take it, hold down the button for five seconds, it goes into a calibration function, and after about 25 to 30 seconds has recalibrated itself automatically. Let me show you how this works. Right now, as you can see, the generator is active and is 362 parts per million. If I blow into this and take the parts per million over my set point, watch what happens. As you can see, the CO2 is raising. Now you see we've exceeded our set point and it's defeated the CO2 generator. Now as this drops, the CO2 controller again will reactivate. The other features I'd like to point out to you on this is, this is an ETL listed device, as you can see on the side here. Uh, it has a three-year warranty that comes with it, um, and it's built with the same high quality, high reliability that you've come to expect from Titan Controls. Well, that's the Atlas III. Thanks for listening, and looking forward to seeing you next time. Thank you very much.